No, guys. Okay, this one is me, right? But no. this one, no. This is what I'm doing, but I'm opening here. Okay, 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 true. Oh, okay, okay. M now. M. Nice, straight. Okay, alright. Alright, we're about to try this out. Can't wait. Get rid of the air bubbles here. M, M, M. Yeah. Yeah. Oh boy, I'm excited. There it is. Pipe goes right in. Uh, nice, no electricity. This is the best. <laughs> M now. Okay, I'm gonna get it to stand anyway. I just I'm gonna set it up. All right, I'm gonna come back. Okay, so um, this is it. Gold tube is working. We put the dream mat underneath. up here.
All right, good morning. So back at the mine site, and uh, just came here to see. Uh, what well, we're just doing a little, uh, a little quick uh, visit, and then we're gonna go back up and have some breakfast. So uh, I'm particularly interested to see if they use a gold cube, but I'm not sure that they did. I think they did not. But um, I've given it some testing. You know, first thing I always try to tell everybody is I'm no expert. You know, I, I don't even know how to pan properly. Uh, but from the testing that I did do, it does seem like the gold cube is actually working. Uh, w the main reason I think it's working is because we actually, I was actually able to recover some very fine gold. I mean, fine gold is so fine that it actually floats on top of the water. And uh, when I checked the waste pile, there was a, there was all, all, a negligible, negligible amount of gold. I mean, it was almost non-existent. So, um, so yeah, so anyway, let's uh, check it out here already. The racket uh, has already started. Kind of can't get away from all the noise. Okay, so. Okay, so I think that's it for now. And, um, yeah, so hopefully later they're gonna be using the gold cube. I mean, understandably, they're a little bit reluctant to, uh, I don't know, I don't know if they're actually, I, I, I assume they're, they may be a little bit reluctant to use the gold cube as opposed to their current system right now because, I mean, if it was me, you know, the current system is what they know and what they, what they know as something that works. The gold cube is a little, it might be unreliable for them, so I can see a little bit of hesitancy, hesitancy of, of, of using the gold cube. In terms of the uh, eliminating mercury use, I, it's definitely not happening this time around. Uh, one of the problems with the gold here is that there's so much pyrite uh, that one of the benefits of the mercury is to separate the gold from the pyrite. So I think the only way that that's going to happen uh, in terms of you know eliminating mercury is one, they'd need a smelter or it's just a way to melt the gold. And uh, even at that, I don't. I, I kind of suspect they'd still be using mercury. I think. I think. I really think the only way of eliminating mercury right now is to invite this, uh, you know, this Apple Global organization and the Filipino miners, uh, you know, who have an actual track record of 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 mining gold without using mercury. And you know, according to them, it actually recovers more gold. So yeah, it should just be like a win-win for the miners. All right.